Welcome back to another cooking tutorial. Some of you have requested the garlic butter sauce and today that's what we are making. We are going to start by warming up our pan to medium heat. Then add your butter. It doesn't matter what kind, you could use your favorite or whatever available butter you have in your fridge. Wait for it to melt completely. And then we add our garlic. And now you might wonder why the heck does my garlic look like that? Well, that is because they were already minced and then they were frozen after. We freeze them so they don't go bad. You can keep them for a long time. And it just makes things easier and quicker every time you have to cook with garlic. Genius, right? So now we just keep on stirring until our garlic unfreezes. And by now, you should have your fire to about a quarter or even the lowest setting because we don't want the garlic to get all burnt. Next, we add our parsley and then we mix it. Just a friendly reminder, make sure your fire is on the low setting now. Next, we add garlic powder for that extra kick of garlic. We mix it a little bit more. And then we add our final tricky ingredient. And I say tricky because you have to be careful with garlic salt. If you put too much, it'll be too salty. But if you just put the right amount, they add good flavor. And now it's time to give your garlic butter sauce a taste. And right now is also the time for you to make some adjustments if you need to. And once again, friendly reminder, your fire should be on the lowest setting. You don't want burnt garlic. Then we give it a final stir, and then we are just about ready to serve it. And just a side note, your pan doesn't need to be that big. I just use that one because it's our only nonstick pan. And now we are ready to serve our garlic butter sauce. And yes, that is leftover memorial bread. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little cooking tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe down below. Happy quarantine cooking and eating.